Galahorn has roared. Ragnarok is near. Tyr, Fenrir, and Loki walk into the battlefield. Ragnarok Squad's main feature is their ability to switch roles mid-fight. Tyr selects between support and assault modes. In the first mode, it repairs all friendly robots around. In another, Tyr loses the ability to repair and some speed, but gains two extra weapons and a physical shield. Simple and powerful. Fenrir works as a fighter or a tank. The assault mode lets the Hellhound to safely reach the fight. Aegis Shield gives it many opportunities to go all-in, without worrying about covers too much. In the tank form, Fenrir loses Aegis, but gets extra damage resistance and another heavy slot. Tank Fenrir is slow, but with a skin that thick, it doesn't matter. Finally, the death trickster Loki. This robot fights with three light weapons in the assault mode, while in the recon mode it falls all weapons and goes into a permanent stealth. With an indefinite stealth and extra movement speed, Loki is amazing for pressuring beacons and is even better for driving your opponents mad. For Tyr, try syncing your weapons choices with teammates. You can repair yourself as well, but to squeeze the most out of your support mode, it is generally better to stick together. We recommend using Scourges and Sparks for close-range combat on Tyr. Pulsar and Maquis combo is better for longer distances. Immobilize with Pulsar, switch form, pulverize with Maquis, rinse, repeat. Tank Fenrir is packed with weapons and is hard to kill, but it is slow. Assault mode is your bet for travel and closing up the distance. In terms of builds, try mixing up two storms with a lockdown chance from Glory. Two scourges with Calamity are incredible for close-range brawling, and two Orcons and Exodus bring you the old-school death button experience. Use Fenrir as if you are a battering ram. Fear nothing, even… Okay, this one can be a headache. Locust stealth allows it to easily get close and personal with enemy, so point-blank weapons are amazing on it. For Loki, we recommend taking triple blades to reliably burn through most defenses. You can also combine two gusts with Halo to catch your enemies off guard. Finally, the cheek is Locus take triple shredder. Just be careful, while in stealth you still can be hit by splash damage or enemies with quantum radar module. That was a Ragnarok Squad overview. Shapeshift your way to victory with Tyr, Fenrir and Loki. See you on the battlefield!